Today we're going to be taking a look at the Aperture Deity condenser microphone and then we're going to do a little studio test. The link to this microphone is in the description below if you want to find out any more about this. Without any further ado, let's see what comes in the box. All right, so it comes in a kind of like Pelican case, super hard and heavy duty. It's actually waterproof, so you can throw this wherever you want and the microphone's gonna be okay. It's got this nice padding on the inside and perfect cutouts for each of the items. Right inside, we can see the microphone itself, the nice little fluffy windshield and a microphone stand mount. You can also pick up the accessory kit which comes with a big furry dead cat and like a shock mount and a whole bunch of other things but this is just going to be looking at the microphone itself. So I've already heard a couple of reviews of this microphone and so far everyone has been blown away at the quality you get for this price range. So this microphone is kind of a knockoff version of a very high-end Sennheiser microphone that a lot of professional like TV shows and movies use. So with that in mind, we're going to do a couple of studio tests. Right now you're listening to the Rode NT1 condenser microphone and it's actually plugged into the Zoom H4n Pro that we have right here. Fantastic recording device I must say. So I'm actually going to unplug the microphone right here, put this on a mic stand, plug it in so we're using all of the same other equipment and then we're going to see how it sounds. All right, so now you're listening to the audio from the Aperture Deity condenser microphone. You'll probably hear a difference just because this is more of a shotgun style um, and the other one was more of a, I don't know, condenser style. It's got a much narrower pickup pattern, which is great for doing like dialogues or interviews or anything like that. I've got it about a foot away from my mouth right now and still using the uh, same Zoom H4n Pro. I'm actually gonna try putting on this uh, mini windshield. It's not gonna be as heavy duty as the dead cat, but if you're gonna be recording anything with a little bit of wind or even like this close with just my breath, um, you're probably gonna wanna put this on. So I'm gonna put this on and not record it because that's gonna sound terrible. All right, so there we go with the little wind cover. You're hopefully not gonna hear much of a difference because there's no wind inside here. I should also note that this room does not have any kind of soundproofing or any sound absorption, so um, it's not anything like that. But generally when you're interviewing somebody or like outside on location, you don't have any kind of soundproofing, so I guess this is kind of like a test of that as well. All right, so it's been about a week since that first initial unboxing of the Aperture Deity microphone, and I actually just got back from a shoot where I used this for the first time in a real situation with real interviews, and I just listened to it, and it sounds pretty darn good. Why don't you have a listen? I think people who really want to learn a new skill, uh, a new like hard skill in, uh, in construction, um, but they also want to learn uh, to work with a variety of personalities. Um, so somebody who's flexible and patient, um, but not necessarily somebody who, uh, you know, who knows everything about construction right off the bat. The program has been so successful that it is now in fi all 50 states and 90 countries worldwide. The first international affiliate was in the Democratic Republic of the Congo at the time Zaire in the 1980s. And today, uh, Habitat for Humanity exists everywhere from Hong Kong to Costa Rica. Hopefully you got something useful from this video. If you have any questions, just leave those down below. I'll also leave the link to this as well in the description if you want to check out that. I'm definitely going to be using this microphone a lot more in the future. So once again, thank you for watching, and as always, don't forget.